All right, let's check out some scores today, huh? Well, the Phillies beat the Braves 7-2. to two. And um, they take two out of three from Atlanta. And the Tigers take two out of three from the Padres, winning at four to three in walk-off fashion. And the Brewers sweep the mini two-game series against the Twins. And of course, the Angels shut out the Royals for nothing and take two out of three, but we have some, some news about Mike Trout that he has a really rare back condition which could possibly, it could possibly halt his career. And um, well, he's, he's, got, he's gotta be careful and take precaution now. I just hope it's not serious for Mike Trout. Yeah, I know that he's I know that he's injury prone, you know. But the good news is that the Dodgers beat the Nationals seven to one, as they avoid the three game sweep. And Patrick Corbin only lasted two thirds of an inning. And uh, and Mookie Betts had. Went two for three today with two walks. Hanser Alberto had two RBIs and so did Gavin Lux with three hits. And uh, Justin Turner came back with an RBI single and everyone contributed. Uh, Phil Bickford got the win in relief today. And yes, that was a much needed win for the Dodgers. Meanwhile, the Rockies beat the White Sox six to five. And hell yes, the A's sweep the Astros as they win 4-2. to two. And yes, Houston is going to have a problem in the second half of the season. Uh, that's got to feel really good. And yes, even more great news. Diamondbacks sweep the hated Giants, winning 5-3. to three. Boy, it feels really good when you sweep your hated rivals. And yeah, they're on a seven-game losing streak to start the season. Yeah. And uh, the Mariners beat the Rangers 4-2 to two and they swept the Rangers. And they're climbing up in the standings. Reds beat the Marlins 5-3. Guardians beat the Red Sox 7-6. Cardinals beat the Blue Jays 6-1 to one, so they split the series. Rays beat the Orioles 6-4. to four. And then the last but not least, the Subway Series. Between the Yankees and the Mets, as the Mets win both games at City Field, Glaber Torres hit a two-run homer in the eighth inning, and Max Scherzer dominated the Yankees with seven shutout innings on his 38th birthday, and Pete Alonso had a solo homer. But I think it was probably um, Starling Marte's game-winning hit in the ninth inning that won it for the Mets. Now that was a great win by the Mets. And with the Yankees losing and the Dodgers winning, the Dodgers lead the uh, lead all of baseball with the best record by three percentage points ahead of the Yankees. And the Dodgers have won 67% of their games. Yeah, I sure hope the Mariners claim first place by the end of the season. Yeah, the Twins, of course. Even though the Angels took two out of three over the, over the Royals, they're still one of the worst teams in baseball. Or Yeah, they trail the Astros by 21 and a half. Yeah. The A's currently have the worst record in the American League. And the Nationals losing today had the worst record in the National League. Yeah. And the Mets have a three-game lead over Atlanta. Brewers have a three-game lead over the Cards. And we lead the Padres by 11 and a half. As we have a happy flight to Colorado. Well, that's all we got for you. Meanwhile, have a great night. 
and I'll catch you all later. Uh, peace out.